Welcome to the amazing world of pencils. Today we're diving into some mind-blowing, game-changing facts about this everyday tool. Did you know the first pencils were actually made without an eraser? That's right. Erasers weren't added until the 1850s. Pencils are made from a mixture of clay and graphite. It's a blend that has withstood the test of time. A single pencil can write up to 45,000 words or draw a line 35 miles long. The word pencil comes from the old French word pencil, meaning a small paintbrush. Before the discovery of graphite, a predecessor to the pencil called a silver point was used for writing and drawing. The modern-day pencil was invented in the 16th century in England. Did you know the average pencil can draw a line that is 35 miles long? Pencils can write in zero gravity, underwater, and even on glass. The famous yellow color of pencils dates back to the late 1800s and was meant to signify luxury and the Orient. Henry David Thoreau designed pencils for his family's pencil factory before he wrote, Walden. The grading of pencils in the U.S. and Europe differs. In the U.S., it's by number, while in Europe, it's by a combination of letters. Mechanical pencils were first patented in 1822 by Samson Morden and John Isaac Hawkins. Pencils are used in space because they don't rely on gravity and don't spill ink. Over 14 billion pencils are produced annually worldwide. Graphite was first discovered in the 1500s in Barrowdale, England. There are over 100 types of pencils, including carpentry pencils, colored pencils, and mechanical pencils. Some pencils can also double as a stylus for touchscreen devices. Ticonderoga is one of the most recognized pencil brands, named after the fort in New York. Pencil shavings are used in various crafts, including jewelry and miniatures. A pencil's core isn't made of lead, it's made of graphite and clay. The largest pencil in the world measures 76 feet and weighs over 18,000 pounds. Pencils can write on wood, stone and fabric. 2B or not 2B? In the world of pencils, that is a fascinating question referring to its hardness. The pencil was voted as one of the world's top 12 design icons by the Design Museum in London. During World War II, pencils were used to conceal maps and other secret documents. Pencils were a common tool used by animators before the advent of digital animation. You can tell a lot about a pencil's quality by the evenness of its sharpening. The eraser end of a pencil is sometimes referred to as a rubber, especially in British English. Countess Markievicz reportedly carried a pistol and a pencil during the Irish War of Independence. Many artists prefer pencil because of the control it offers in shading and lines. Pencil sketching is one of the oldest forms of art. Contrary to popular belief, chewing on a pencil won't give you lead poisoning. Pencils have been involved in many scientific innovations, including the development of early computers. The phrase, the pencil test, once referred to using a pencil to measure how curly a person's hair was. The simple pencil has even made its way into idioms and sayings like, the pen is mightier than the sword. In the movie, The Dark Knight, the Joker used a pencil in a now iconic magic trick. Each pencil has a hexagonal shape to prevent it from rolling off desks. Pencil stubs have a special name, stubbies. Dog earing the end of a pencil is a common way to fidget and pass time. Writing with pencils engages more areas of your brain than typing does. Thanks for tuning in to these mind-blowing facts about pencils. Don't forget to subscribe for more fascinating insights.